Do you want to dramatically improve your sleep, but you don't know how? Well, sleep supplements and sleep nootropics can help. But which are the most effective ones? Let's find out. Hey, what's up? Greg here, the founder of Your Inception. Welcome to my channel where you can learn top secrets about nootropics. Subscribe below to start your journey. We live in a time when one third of all Americans are sleep deprived. And this number does not even include people who have certain sleep related issues, such as insomnia, for example. Now, you might think one third is not that much, but if you know how important sleep is, especially for cognitive performance and overall health, well, you should be worried about it. Well, the question is, how can we improve sleep quality? Are there any natural ways to do that? Well, absolutely, we can do that by taking certain sleep supplements or sleep nootropics. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you the best sleep nootropics that can help you fall asleep faster. And I'm gonna talk about the best sleep nootropics for improving a better sleep. And at the end, I'm gonna show you and tell you where you can find the best sleep supplements that you can currently buy on the market. Let's begin. Oh, by the way, are you currently taking any sleep supplements? Let me know in the comment section below. So just before I share with you the best sleep nootropics, I wanna mention three crucial reasons why sleep is so important. First of all, we form memories during our sleep. And that's important enough. If you wanna achieve a great cognitive performance, you need to ensure you're gonna sleep for a long period or at least ensure a high quality sleep because that's when uh, the memories are formed and if you wanna perform high, that's what you need. Secondly, great sleep improves your focus and your overall cognitive performance. Many studies show how sleep is important for normal brain functioning. And if you don't sleep enough or you know the quality of your sleep is not good enough, well, your brain will suffer from that. And thirdly, sleep is directly related to your weight. So it has been proven that people who sleep less are often more obese, um, and you know this comes with many health issues. So those are just three important reasons why you should really worry about sleep. But now let's move to nootropics and see which one can help you out. Oh guys, and just one important thing, sleep nootropics or sleep supplements are not equal to sleeping pills. Now sleeping pills can knock you out very quickly, uh, but they usually come with many side effects. Sleep nootropics on the other side are much safer and much better for you, much healthier in many different ways, but they're not as strong. So they usually help you fall asleep uh, faster. They can help you relax and then they can help you achieve a higher quality sleep. And that's what you eventually wanna do anyway. So just that you know this difference. So if you wanna fall asleep quicker, here are the nootropics that can help you out. First of all, here's Bacopa Moneri. Bacopa Moneri is an adaptogen herb that is known for improving focus, improving cognitive performance, and it can help you relax, and also it can help you fall asleep faster. So Bacopa has been used for centuries. It is basically a herb, and um, it's very safe, and there are many studies proving the positive effects and benefits of Bacopa Moneri. Now you can take Bacopa in the morning for better cognitive performance, but you can take it in the afternoon or evening just to feel more relaxed. The recommended daily dosage is around 300 milligrams of Bacopa per day. Another nootropic that is very effective is GABA. Now GABA is a, as you might probably know, is a neurotransmitter, but you can also supplement GABA to increase the levels of it in your brain. Now the issue with it is that it doesn't cross the blood brain barrier. So usually it is supplemented with some other um, ingredients or nootropics such as L-citrulline, which is an amino acid because this improves uh, or increases the, the chances that it's gonna basically cross the barrier. Now, if you're gonna search for studies of how supplementing GABA can improve or make you fall asleep faster, you're not gonna find many, but based on my experience with GABA, it really seems to work and it really seems to provide a lot of benefits. Another tropic that I wanna talk about is called lavender. Now this is a plant, a very popular one. If you ever traveled on the south of France, you're gonna see there like kilometers and kilometers of it. And the thing with lavender is they usually make oils out of it. Um, so if you smell this oil, this has been shown that this can increase your sleep quality. But not just that, I found a study where people were supplementing lavender and they seen an increase of sleep quality from 14 to I think 24% in just 10 weeks. So that's quite a dramatic increase for a supplement or for a herb like this. 
So lavender is very, seems to be very potent and very popular. You can find it in many great nootropic supplements. The recommended daily dosage is somewhere between 80 to 160 milligrams. Another nootropic that I wanna talk about is called L-tryptophan. Now L-tryptophan is an amino acid that converts into 5-HTP. And 5-HTP turns into serotonin, which is an important neurotransmitter also for sleep quality. Also, L-tryptophan can influence the production of melatonin. That's why it is an important amino acid for improving your sleep quality. However, currently the exact recommended daily dosage has not been established yet. Let's continue with magnesium. I'm sure you heard about magnesium before. It is one of the most vital minerals for overall health. But among other things, it can also maintain healthy levels of GABA, the neurotransmitter we talked about before. It can also regulate our bio clock. And of course, it has many other indirect influences on our sleep quality. That's why magnesium is very, very important. And I would want to see it in every serious uh, sleep supplement on the market. The recommended daily dosage kind of varies from the type of magnesium you have, but on average, it is somewhere between 200 to 400 milligrams per day. By the way, guys, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. Use a hashtag AskYourInception and I will weekly answer some of the most interesting questions that I will receive. Another tropic that I want to talk about is called melatonin. Now, I'm sure you heard about it before. Melatonin is a hormone that is crucial for establishing good sleep. Actually, it increases naturally in the evening when you know it gets darker outside and it decreases naturally in the morning when you know the sun rises. Um, but you can of course also supplement it. And you know the supplementation has been shown to be very effective for improving your sleep quality, your overall quality, but also to help people fall asleep faster because you increase it a bit earlier and then of course you uh, get more tired. Now the recommended daily dose which is sound routine uh, 0 0.5 milligrams to 5 milligrams but of course be careful not to overdose it because if you take it every single day for a longer period you might get dependent or your body won't be able to produce melatonin naturally it's gonna be so effective in doing that so you know I would stay kind of on the lower dose so up to 1 milligram per day and if you talked about melatonin there's a thing called tart cherry or uh, Montmorency tart cherry and tart cherry is a natural source of melatonin. So the one we talked about before is a basically a synthetic one, but this is a natural source. So you can basically get it just from eating uh, cherries, but if you uh, supplement it, it's proven to be very, very effective. But not just for increasing the overall sleep quality, but also to support your joints and muscles. So um, it provides some important antioxidants to your body as well. And based on my studies, and the research that I've done, the recommended daily dosage is around 400 to 500 milligrams per day. Last but not least, let's talk about valerian. Valerian is a herb that you can find in different parts of the world and it is often used to treat anxiety and even depression. So it can help you get more relaxed and it's great if you wanna, you know, before uh, falling asleep, if you wanna be more relaxed, you wanna feel a bit, you know, calmer basically. And Valeria is one of the most popular sleep supplements or sleep nootropics in the world, there's no doubt about it. There has been a study done that shows that supplementing Valeria, somewhere between 300 to 900 milligrams per day, uh, seems to be very effective in helping people fall asleep faster. By the way guys, I've revealed seven special secrets about nootropics that no one else will tell you about. To get them, download my free handbook below. All right, guys, so we just talked about the best sleep nootropics that can help you fall asleep faster. Some of them can do both, so help you fall asleep faster and achieve a better quality sleep. But which are the nootropics that are mainly used for improving the quality of your sleep? So first one, there's Huperzin A. Now, this is a popular nootropic uh, that is used in many uh, supplements for improving cognitive performance because that's what it can do as well. But at the same time, some studies have shown that it can increase the quality of your sleep. What it does is it influences the rapid eye movement, uh, which is one cycle of several cycles that you go through uh, throughout the night. The recommended daily dosage is up to 200 micrograms per day, but Huperzin A requires cycling, so you can take it for a couple of days, then you have to stay off for a couple of days and repeat this uh, for basically a longer longer period, because otherwise you might experience, you, you might become dependent and you wanna avoid that. L-theanine is a nootropic that is used for improving sleep quality. This is a popular amino acid found in green tea, 
or in leaves basically of green tea. If you drink green tea, you get a lot of L-theanine and you usually recommend daily dosages around 200 milligrams. L-theanine is used not just for improving sleep quality, also for helping people relax, but apparently one of the studies show that people who were given 200 milligrams of L-theanine had a severely improved sleep. So that's why it is in this category and it seems very potent. I love L-theanine and I, I like to see it in, in sleep supplement. It's not necessary to have it, but if it is, it's, it's really good. And another compound is picamilan. Picamilan is basically a more complex nootropic because it consists of two compounds, vitamin B3 and GABA. Now the recommended daily dosage has not been established yet, but people who have taken this uh, supplement or this nootropic have said that they had a dramatically improved sleep. So that's why this is something to consider. It's not necessary, but it is another compound that might be beneficial. All right, guys, so we just covered a lot of uh, very effective nootropics for improving your sleep and nootropics that can help you get more relaxed in the evening. Now, what you can do is you can buy each individual compound separately. You can mix them together at home. You can test them if you want to. But what I recommend is buying a nootropic uh, stack or a very effective sleep supplement that consists of many of the nootropics that we mentioned because that's how you get more of, of effective compounds uh, together, you don't have to weigh them at home, mix them, you don't have to experiment basically. So which is the most uh, effective sleep supplement on the market? Now we have a very special procedure of testing and evaluating sleep supplements and we constantly upgrade our list based on all the tests we've we do basically. So if you want to find the most effective sleep supplement, check out the links below and you can click on it and learn everything about our procedures about the most effective uh, sleep supplements on the market. Now we are constantly updating this list as I said before uh, because we always want to uh, help you find the most effective supplements and that's why we do not promote one particular sleep supplement We're not sponsored by any brands. We want to avoid that But once we found very effective supplements that we want to take ourselves Then we share them with you through the links below and you can always buy them uh, And of course try them at home So if you want to really improve your sleep sleep nootropics can definitely help you out I personally recommend taking sleep supplements or sleep stacks this means more nootropic compounds taken together. As I said, the links below. If you have any questions about nootropics, let me know. Uh, don't forget to follow your inception on Facebook and Instagram. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And I hope to see you soon, guys. Take care.